हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम अगेन एंड दिस इज मैं प्रोजेक्ट द स्कूल मे मे सिस्टम एंड आई हैव डेवलप दिस प्रोजेक्ट इन वी पी डॉट नेट एंड डेटा बेस आई एम यूजिंग इज माई स्कूल राइट एंड द वर्जन विजुअल स्टूडियो वर्जन आई एम यूजिंग विजुअल स्टूडियो टू थाउजेंड नाइनटीन एंड माई स्कूल वर्जन आई एम यूजिंग माई स्कूल वर्जन फाइव पॉइंट सिक्स ऑल्सो फॉर रनिंग द माई स्कूल डेटा बेस आई एम यूजिंग द पी एच यू माई एडमिन राइट सो दिस ऑल टेक्नोलॉजी स्टैक्स आई हैव यूज फॉर डेवलपिंग दिस प्रोजेक्ट दिस इज अ विंडो बेस्ड एप्लीकेशन एंड ऑल ऑफ द फॉर्म्स वी हैव डेवलप्ड इन साइड द वी बी वी बी डॉट नेट यू कैन सी दिज आर द फॉर्म्स अवेलेबल हेयर इन द लेफ्ट साइड सॉरी राइट साइड बार राइट सो फॉर रनिंग दिस प्रोजेक्ट जस्ट ऑफ इन द एस एल एन फाइल एंड आफ्टर दैट रन द क्लिक ऑन द स्टार्ट बटन राइट वन से क्लिक ऑन द स्टार्ट बटन इट विल स्टार्ट लोडिंग राइट सो यू कैन सी इट्स लोडिंग दिस इज द is plus form you can see this is this plus form and this is a login form right here you need to enter the user id and password for access in the internal pages right so the user id is admin and the password is test so once you log in inside the system right then it will show this mdi form mdi form is it's it will contain multiple forms right so here this is the logout and exit application so i will explain you later this is the student management once you click on this then you will be able to see the student management form here is the close button save update new and delete right so you can manage the student records from here right so if you want to update any record just double click on that and after that you will be able to see the record details and you can update the record like rahul jain one right suppose this one then yaar and if you click on the update process updated you can see this has been updated right this four drop downs are coming from the database right sorry this drop down is coming from the database post drop down is coming from the database right so now i am closing it now this is the time table and here you can add the time table for the school right so you can see this is a time table and you can select the time subject name and all here right and after that you will be able to even you can add or update so currently there are five records if i click on the add then you can see the sixth record has been added right for so this is for managing the time table you can perform the delete activation delete update clear and uh, add operations here right so now the next one is a course management here you can manage the course you can see all of the courses are here and this courses will be reflected in different drop downs right so here from here you can manage the courses right and so you can see you can see this is the courses there is a save update new and delete right so if you want to click on new then the form will be cleared out and after that you will be able to filter the record so you will be able to fill new records and you can save right the same the faculty management here you can see the faculty you can update the faculty you can add the faculty this is the same crud application create read update and operation for the faculties right the same the next one is the attendance management from here you can manage the attendance right so here you can see there is a search button right you can click on this and after that you can search the student right so if you click on this then you can see the student had been selected and the roll number and the course name is auto fill right and there is two type present or absent if you click on the present and see then you can see the fifth record the 12th id number has been recorded and you can see the details here right and uh, if you if data doesn't lo load just click on the refresh and it will be refreshed out right this is a fees management again this is the browse student if you click on the browse then the uh, all students who which are available in the database will be displayed here and if you click on any record then it will fill those things and you can academic year total fees paid fees and revenues and after filling off all of the records you can save right and you can update it right you can see process updated successfully because i have not filled the record right okay so the last one is about so this is a static page if you want to add your names contact number or team name you can change this page and you can add your names and data here right the last option is the file logout and exit application if i click on the logout and exit application then this application will be closed and the page will be this page will be loaded here right so this is the all of the forms so i have created 1 2 3 4 5 6 
seven seven modules here right so you can see all of the forms are the modules right all of the forms right all of the all we have developed in vb.net and database we have used in MySQL, right as i told you earlier this is a my this is a windows based application so these all features i have developed inside this project is full management system but if you need new features if you need any type of enhancement in this project just put it into the comments we will incorporate those changes we will make this project more bit and bit according to requirements and don't forget to subscribe our channel for getting the latest project videos on the latest technologies thanks for watching the video thank you very much